Welcome to Medicine Woman Tarot. This is going to be a general reading for the sign of Aries. Please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Father God, in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ, help me to give a clear and accurate reading for the sign of Aries. If you'd like to make any donations towards my channel, you can find the link in the description section. Just as a side note, with any donation you give, if you choose to, you could ask me a question in the comment section, and I will make a tarot video for you answering that question. I want to apologize in advance for any background noise you may hear due to the dog's snoring. All right, before starting the video, I sprayed the pink gem for you today, and what showed up was very interesting. Um, what showed up was a man, and he was dressed in a knight's armor, and he had dark hair. He was not wearing a helmet, and he looked very, you know, very strong and very, you know, proud individual. I was not picking up a bad vibe at all, but what showed up after that was a woman, and the woman had a face, uh, a round face, kind of resembled that of a cabbage patch, if that makes sense. She had dark hair, which I feel is very prominent in what's showing up in your reading, where you're being warned about. Uh, she's heavy set. She has kind of like a, like a stubby type nose, and she was wearing a puffy sleeved shirt, where the sleeves are very puffy at the upper part of the arm. It was low cut, and it was a kind of like a belly shirt, and she was kind of like a V neck. What's interesting is that she had a sword sticking out of her head. So with that showing up, this represents that there could be some type of betrayal from this individual, but they, it is going to be short-lived where this person will be struck down by bad karma, you know, where God sees what this person is doing to you and it's going to end up going back on this individual. But it, it kind of reminded me of like the Bible where it mentions about the one that had the sword in the head. So just be aware of this individual. I feel like they're very two-faced. Two now, the card to come out for you, I believe another sign got this card tonight, is the Ace of Chalices, the Samaritan woman at the well. And it says, just whoever drinks the water I give them, let me start over again, sorry about that. But whoever drinks the water I give them will never thirst. Indeed, the water I give them will become in them a spring of water, welling up of internal life. So it's a beautiful message that's coming out for you. And this represents hope. It it also represents divine protection and, you know, Jesus very much being with you. And according to the biblical tarot, the ace of chalices represents this happiness and this joy, spiritual awakening, embracing new perspectives, inner transformation, acceptance, and understanding deeper emotional of spiritual truth. So very good cards come out for you. Now, the next card to come out for you is the star card. And the star card here reads guaranteed success. So this is representing guaranteed success. You're being divinely blessed here with the star card energy. This is rep representing happiness and success in whatever it is that you are trying to manifest. But there is jealousy around you because you do have the parrot card to come out. And it says someone will gossip about you and whatever you confided in this person so be aware of whoever this person is be aware of trying to um, be close to this individual because this person is going to try to uh, slander you gossip about you possibly make up lies about you trying to um, act out in a fit of jealousy because of your success and your blessings now the next card out for you is, it says, Dark Woman, Dealings or Relationships with a Woman with Dark Complexion or Hair. And I feel like this is representing that individual who is showing up, who is very jealous of you. And you also have another card to come out as well, representing that. Next card out for you is Owl, and it represents good advice from a wise person. So you will learn about this through word of mouth as well before it actually is revealed to you you also have the card scales keep your life in balance so continue to keep your life in balance especially when this person is you know trying to cause havoc next card out for you is boat money or property through an inheritance or winning or windfall so this represents unexpected financial abundance and good things coming your way next card out for you is the bible verse be on guard stand firm in the faith be courageous and be strong so that's a beautiful message has come out for you as well. Now the next card out is the strange companions and stranger places. Challenges, use your imagination. So this is representing someone being, you know, an enemy in disguise. Someone that smiles in your face but is really your enemy. So just be aware of this individual. I do pick up that it is a feminine energy. You also got the card of plant can sensitivity, letting you know to listen to the plants around you because even they have a spirit within them. 
and to use more plants for medicinal use. Next card out for you is the Bible verse Tulsi Faith, and this card has lots of symbolism in itself. Sorry about the lighting, trying to get that to come in without the glare. Now, this card represents that you are going to receive greater understanding in time as long as your faith stays firm. So just understand that if you're going through a difficult situation, hold on to your faith and know that God is divinely guiding you. If you're concerned about something, try to take a break from it and then return to it. And it's letting you know as well. It's a wink and a nod from God to let you know that you're walking down a divine path that you are meant to be on. So it's a very good card to come out. And it's letting you know as well here that this card has lots of medicinal benefits, this plant, I should say. It is also called holy basil, and it could be used to lower cholesterol, blood pressure, and it could be good in treating treatment of cancer, providing protection and support during radiation therapy, and has many other medicinal benefits that are worth looking into. So all in all, I see a very positive reading here for you. Just know that you have this star energy, and just be aware of this person who is very jealous of you. All right, Aries, if this resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. As always, it's greatly appreciated.